Hello everyone, Ken Welsh here. I am uh, on my way out of the USANA International Convention for 2010. Uh, another amazing convention. I loved it. I mean the people, the energy, the enthusiasm. I mean what a high when you leave there. It's just there's so much great energy and so many good people and you know what a company, what great products. You know, this, I can't say enough good things about everything that transpired there, the new connections, the support. Um, I, I just wanted to quickly mention one of the things that really hit home with me was the um, Aaron Din. I got to uh, listen to Aaron and, uh, and Nancy and wow, I mean, I think they're just two great people. They're part of the uh, NE2 group, and you know there were so many things that they talked about. I mean, all the good points that I can, I'll just quickly mention. Uh, one is appreciation of everything. I mean, everything that's around you. I don't care what it is, just appreciate it, and that leads to appreciation of uh, more things and. You know you're gonna you're gonna get more things to appreciate. Bottom line, so everything that you have, appreciate it. Um, and what's your worth? I mean, what do you believe you're worth? Because you're worth more than you think you are. I can guarantee you that. I know I am. I've I've thought low of myself for too many years, and I see how they've come up and what they've done, and they're doing wonderful things. Um, just because of their belief system so it's time to change that um, and when you're out represent your company like represent it like it's a million dollar business because that's what it is and that's the people that you're going to attract you know look for those type of people look for people that are you know ready to take their lives to the next level to build their business to be million dollar people and above all have fun with it like enjoy it make it fun for them make it fun for you Yes, it's a business, but you want to take it seriously, but enjoy it at the same time. So, uh, another good point that I got out of it was the um, there's no excuses. I mean, there's no excuses that you can say whatever you want and play victim all you want, but it doesn't matter. That isn't going to help your situation, nor is it going to help anybody else. So, my takeaway from that was. What can I do for others? Not so much that it's about myself, but what can I do for others? You know, upline, downline, crossline, doesn't matter. Um, there's unlimited potential um, in me and in you. So stay strong. You know, hold to your goals. Hold, hold to your time uh, that you set for yourself and set new limits. So. Remember that business comes first. Um, set a strategy, strategy uh, to set things up and know exactly what you're looking for. Have a big vision and uh, believe in yourself. So it's just a matter of time. So how much time do you want to put into it? You know, share share the experiences. I think is a big one for me too. So. Visualize. I'm, what I'm about to do is visualize a, a, my team and see what it's going to be looking like and be present with everybody that I'm working with and help them to achieve their goals. So that's just one of the tidbits from a, uh, Aaron Din and Nancy on the uh, team culture. And I'm going to uh, come up or go back into my notes and, and deal with some uh, new topics on that because I wrote so much down. But that's just a little tidbit of what I'd like to share. So thanks uh, again, Ken Welsh, and have a wonderful day. Bye for now.